Welcome back to Vision Explorer. As we all know, in today's world, most of our devices require a USB cable connection so that they can connect with other devices. Some common examples where USB cable connection is used include mouse and keyboard connection, in external hard drives, and in device chargers, and etc. etc. So we can say that data cable has become one of the most important part of our life. So while purchasing a new USB cable, it becomes very important for us to know about its specifications and furthermore, we should also pay heed towards the inner material of the USB cable. So to know how much important does it serves, let's begin. USB stands for Universal Serial Bus and there are basically 4 wires inside USB cable and each wire has its own purpose. So the most commonly used 4 wires along with their purpose and color code are Red wire, it is a positive power wire and the next is Black wire, it is a ground wire and the next is White wire, it is a positive data wire and the last we have got is Green wire, it is a negative data wire. Sometimes it is possible that a USB cable's inner wire has different color combination and has different meaning other than which we talked about. For example, it may be orange wire, it will be a positive power wire and the next is white wire, it will be a ground wire and the next is blue wire, it will be a negative data wire and the last we have got is green wire, it will be a positive data wire. Now let's talk about the material which is used for making internal wire of USB cable. Let's first have a look at electrical resistivity table. But before moving into this, we have to understand two terms, electrical conductivity and electrical resistivity. Electrical conductivity and electrical resistivity both are reciprocal terms. Conductivity refers to how well a material conducts or flow electric current and resistivity refers to the resistance of current flow which is given by a conductor of unit length and unit cross section area. Now we know what is electrical conductivity and electrical resistivity. And now maybe you have got the idea that now these terms are going to help us. And if you are thinking about electrical resistivity table, then yes, you are right. With the help of that table, we are going to find who is the best conductor. So as you can see the table in your screen, silver is most conductive material, followed by copper, then gold and then aluminium. And the list goes on. But as silver is expensive material, usually copper is used for making wires. And moreover, copper has some other properties too, for which it is being used in making electrical wires. And some of them are high conductivity, high ductility, and good thermal resistance. So these are some of the reasons that why most of the USB cable manufacturers use copper as inner wire of the USB cable. But wait, the video is not over yet. Can aluminium also be used for making inner wire of USB cable? Because as we can see after silver, copper and gold, aluminium has highest conductivity and gold is also expensive material even more expensive than silver. So again it can't be used for making inner wires of USB cable. So now we are left with aluminium which is cheaper than copper. So can it serve the purpose? Although copper is more conductive than aluminium. But here is a little twist, aluminium provides better conductivity to weight ratio than copper. That means for same conductivity, copper will weigh heavier than aluminium and again if conductivity is same then cross section of aluminium will be more as compared to copper. So for this reason and along with its cheap cost and lightweight as compared to copper, aluminium is preferred in overhead power connections. But copper wins in factors like tensile strength, coefficient of expansion, stability and in some other factors too. So copper is preferred in home electrical wiring. And also expansion and contraction cycle in aluminium is greater than copper due to which connection get loosened over time and hence it can increase the risk of fire from arcs. So a periodic checkup is needed for such wiring. Although advancement in technology has taken place to fix this problem but safety is first priority and to reduce chances of house fires, copper is preferred for home wiring. So finally, it depends on our need, against which situation we are dealing. And talking about USB cable, after searching too much from different USB cable manufacturers website, the verdict is that, some of them does not mention 
and some of them mentioned that which material they use for inner wiring and those who mentioned they mostly said they use copper wire. There is hardly any manufacturer who said that they use aluminium wire but in feedback some customer claims that the wire is of aluminium. So most manufacturers are preferring copper wire for USB cable and yes surely there may be some reasons like good tensile strength, good coefficient of expansion and moreover good stability and conductivity than aluminium. So that's why manufacturers and customers both prefer copper wire in USB cables. But as said it depends on our need. If there is different purpose then we might develop different method and technique and hence the material which fits the best in that situation it will be used. So if you think the video is worthy to watch then please leave a like and make sure that you have subscribed the channel and if you want to spread the knowledge then please try to share the video with your family and friends. So till now thanks for watching.